Returning as Kingpin, uh, I'm curious, did you consider it a different iteration of the character with a different backstory, or do you look at it as a continuation of the Wilson Fisk that we already know? I think it's definitely a continuation. Like, Mm -hmm. there's no difference to me. There's the physical strength that's different. The fact that he can take more kind of violent abuse, you know, physical abuse is different. But I'm, you know, it's very clear with the, was very clear with the writers and the producers and the directors that that I'm continuing the same man that was in the, the series a few years ago in Daredevil. So his emotional life, he, he, he operates through the pain of his childhood. That's how he operates. And he still does. It doesn't matter whether he's enjoying himself or if he's having a tough time in life, whatever's going on in any scene, he's always, it's always coming through events that happened when he was a kid. And so that's the same character to me. And, you know, we definitely knew that I definitely knew that this was after the blip and that, and that he's had less power than he did. And he wanted his city back for the, for Hoffman. That's the way I approached it. So, yeah, I think in my mind, I, I don't know how they think about it at Marvel overall, but in my mind, I think that it's they connect as many dots as they can in the canon stuff and with the canon uh, state of mind. And and some dots are impossible to connect, but uh, most are easy to connect. And I think that's what they try and do. I definitely have to ask you about that ending scene in the finale with Maya, um, kind of that final confrontation, because I think... Unfortunately, it leaves a little bit up in the uh, up in the air in terms of the fate of your character. When you were approached to reprise the role, was it indicated to you that Hawkeye was only the beginning of Kingpin being back in the MCU? You know, it only put personally, I can comment personally. I can't comment about any kind of facts because you they just don't tell me. So <laughs> it made me a hope that it would continue and it still makes me feel that way. I mean, in my mind, he's definitely, she definitely shot him. And, you know, I look, I walked away from Daredevil thinking that, you know, at first I thought maybe it'll come back somehow. And then very quickly after that, I thought I was walking away for good, you know? So I had always hoped because of the fans wanted it back and everybody had always hoped that it would come back. So I feel the same way now. I think that's actually all the time that I have, but I will say, you know, there is an Echo spinoff that's been announced. I'm sure you're aware. So that feels kind of like a good opportunity to see a little more of Wilson Fisk in the future. I think it would be great. I remember the the comic run. It was one of my favorites of the father-daughter relationship between Maya and him. I would love the opportunity to do that. Um, Well, it was great to see you return and thank you so much for taking the time to sit and chat. I really appreciate your time. You're welcome. Thanks. Happy holidays to you. You too. Thank you.